Hello folks, how's it going? Are you alright? Yeah, I haven't done a vid for a while. Um, mainly I, I, I mean, I've, I've got subject matter that I can do videos uh, about. I just haven't got around to doing stuff really. Just been a little bit busy. Um, just, a, just a quick heads up, really. Um, the event domain website is is going under a bit of a redesign. Um, I'll get that done within the next, hopefully, um, sort of couple of months. Um, so that'll be a whole new design, have a complete new look on it, um, and it'll be it, 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 it'll be a lot better. Uh, moving on, um, some of you might remember I did a video on I purchased a pair of Nike Lunas from Sports Direct which I was really really pleased with really happy with them um, shelled out about it's about 54 quid 52 54 quid something like that well <laughs> yeah uh, I was doing the laces up the other day and uh, it snapped yeah there you go Completely, the, the loop snapped as I was pulling it tight, so I had to do a bit of a, a um, find a sort of a remedy, and I, 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 I laced these up to the top, to the top uh, holes there, and thought that that would solve the problem. And so I've gone to do them up, and that they're, they're, they're still, you know, they're, they're fairly tight around the around the foot, but. They're just not tight around this part here, which is a bit of a problem for me. Uh, might not irritate somebody else, but it irritates the hell out of me. But anyway, so <clears throat> I, I probably won't wear those ever again now. And it, it's a shame because I've only had them six months, so, so, well, about, about seven months, I suppose. And you know, although I could wear them a push, you know, they're just not very tight. So I had to get those replaced. And I replaced them with these. Now these are British Knights BK Roccos, okay, and they were 40, 44, 44, hang on, 40, 40, 44.99 down to um, 22.99. So for 23 quid. They're pretty good. Now, the thing about these is you, you'll need to know that these are, um, they are a little bit tight around the toe area. Lengthwise, they're, they're fine. They, these, are, these are size 11, um, but they were just a little bit tight for me. So, but once I've been wearing them, for like a few minutes, you, you, you just get used to it. So, you know, they are fine. and. I imagine you know these are gonna these are gonna loosen up. They are gonna stretch a bit. Uh, <clears throat> okay, looking at looking at the shoe here. Um, it's also come in grey. It was actually the grey pair that I wanted, but the guy brought these out, so I'm assuming they didn't have any grey in stock. So I'm a little bit miffed about that. I wanted the grey ones. Um, they look to be they're, they're a very sturdy shoe. Okay. They're, these are not flexible, okay? They, they, they flex here, but that's the only place they flex. Uh, they don't flex anywhere else. <laughs> that's it, they flex there and that's that. So, you know, they're, they're okay for walking in. I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend that you run in them because they, 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 they haven't got a running kind of sole. That, that, that's the sole there, as you can see. So you know you haven't got that sort of the grip. So the grip's pretty good. They're, they're, they're quite grippy, you know, and the support is very very good uh, around the ankle area. Um, it's it's nice and tight. It's not overly tight. So you know they are quite comfortable. They're just not as comfortable as uh, a pair of running shoes. And these are actually forty four ninety nine. Forty five quid these 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 boys are. Um, I was quite shocked at that um, because. You know they're not actually that comfortable. I mean, yeah, they're, they're, they're okay. You know, I mean, you can walk in them. For, you could probably. I mean, I, I I walked in them for about an hour and they felt 
all right. They felt okay. But I don't know whether I'll be able to stand sort of half a day in them or a day or something. I, I don't know. I mean, I haven't worn them for that long, so I mean, I don't know. But um, if, if, if you want a quick fix trainer and you want like a spare trainer or something just as a backup pair or something out in the rain, um, you know, these, these will be fine. They'll, they'll be okay. As I say, um, if you want something that, that, that's great support on the ankle, this, this will definitely, definitely do the job. And at 23 quid, I, I, I couldn't really complain. You know, I, 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 I couldn't really. I saw them, um, I, I looked at some other stuff, I looked at some cloth type trainers, and you know, they were going for like sort of 16 quid, and I thought, no, I'm not gonna buy those, because if it rains, I'm gonna be screwed. So, you know, I want some little bit of protection. I don't want soaking wet feet. <laughs> uh, so I thought, I'll buy these. These would be all right. You know, I have worn them a few times. They're pretty good. They're all right. They're, they're not the most comfortable thing in the world. I can still feel the ground as I'm walking in them. But for 23 quid, you can't really go wrong. So, yeah, I would, I would recommend these. So, um, what, what I'm, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Okay. Um, I'll try and stick up another video at some point, but I just wanted to do a quick review on this, really, because I, I, I thought it was quite important. You know, if people were thinking about buying British Knights, um, they're okay. You know, they're all right. Um, I don't think they're as good as Nike or Reeboks, but you know, it, it, it's it's not a bad, not a bad trainer, not a bad shoe. Just thought I'd drop my two penny worth in there for what it's worth. So there you go. This is the the main man um, signing off, and yeah, thanks very much for tuning in. See you next time. Cheers.